Thank you, Jesus. I can finally sit down and take off this doggone wig, honey. Lord, I got to put this doggone wig back on my head, Jesus. No, I don't. Now I can go to the store in peace. I'm definitely not the naturalist, most natural person on earth. Hey, little bells, it's your girl, Disastrous Beauty, coming back with the voiceover. So this unit was sent to me by Zerisus. Shout out to you, Zerisus, for sending me this unit. This unit, as you guys can see, the construction of it, it has two columns in the front, one column in the back with adjustable straps. And as you guys can see, this wig has no lace. This unit is a scarf wig. It's for throw on and go for casual days. And it is in the style SFH Trez in the color LP1B. And like I say, it's just like a wig that you can just throw on and run to the store or for casual days when you're just kind of laying around the house. And right here, you can see me tying the scarf different ways and trying to give you guys some styling options. Um, if you're interested in any more details and specs about this unit, then please continue to watch. And I will see you love us in the outro. Bye. finished out this wig and this is what I got if you're interested in the details the specs and all that good stuff about this unit then please continue to watch okay so this unit was sent to me by Zuri Sus shout out to you Zuri Sus for sending me this unit <laughs> y'all I know y'all when I took this unit out y'all were probably like oh, what the what is that okay and I was kind of like what the what is that too when they sent me a picture of it I ain't gonna even <clears throat> I ain't gonna even hold you, sis. Okay, so this a unit. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys the specs and stuff that I have on here, and then we will talk more about like my thoughts on it and more details about the wig in general. Okay, so it's called uh, scarf wig throw on and go for casual days. Scarf with wig attached, high heat resistant up to 400 degrees. The wig style name is F. I mean, SFH Trez, and um, the color is LP1B. And then on the back, it's kind of like telling you different ways that you can wear the scarf. So I'm gonna show you guys this right here. And this also is showing you different ways you can wear the scarf too. I'm gonna let you see the name of it. And it also is giving you wash and care instruction. It says, quick and easy to wear. And they have three, um, two other styles. I just chose this one, but they also have um, this style and this style as well. I feel like this scarf is coming up. So yeah, this unit comes with two columns in the front, one column in the back with adjustable straps. Um, there's literally nothing up here. There's no lace, like there's nothing up here. It's just, just this scarf. And, um, and then this hair is like, is, is, I don't know, just consider the scarf your lace, okay? <laughs> That's the best way I can describe it. Okay, so yeah, um, as far as shedding and tangling goes with this wig, um, I definitely feel like it's tangly. Um, shedding, there is some shedding. Like I'm literally pulling it out. Because I only finger comb the hair, I'm not really sure like but I am getting some, I'm getting some shedding. And as far as big head friendliness goes, like 
um, I have on both uh, a wig, I mean a wig grip, and I adjusted the strap. So I feel like it is big head friendly, and I, I don't, don't think this is the kind of wig that it would be an issue if it wasn't. You know what I mean? I don't think it would be an issue if it was big head friendly or small head friendly because you got the scarf. So I don't think that would be an issue either way. And yeah, y'all, that is pretty much it. So. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys um, a lint check. So this is where it comes to me. Keep in mind, I am 5'4". This is where it comes to me in the back. And y'all know what I say about my rolls, honey. Don't mind them, they're for dinner. Now, that is pretty much it as far as this wig goes, um, as far as cap construction. If you are interested in more details and specs about this unit, um, then please continue to watch. So what do I think about this wig? I think it is a really, really unique idea. Um, I feel like I would have liked for the scarf to be uh, thicker or something like something about the scarf is just not sitting well with me It's kind of like rising and I don't know if it's because it's a silk scarf. Usually when I do scarves like this, um, I use, I have another scarf. I actually use scarves that I wear around my neck to to do these type of styles in it because I really want to do the, the, the top knot. And I feel like, I honestly don't, I don't know, I could be wrong, but I feel like the, the scarf that they have on these pictures is not the same scarf. I could be wrong, okay? But I couldn't get this scarf in no bun like that. And I used to wear my, y'all know, if you are OG, disastrous beauty watcher you know i used to wear my hair um my scarf and that little top knot all the time and it had to be a longer scarf this scarf isn't very long and it's super silky and i don't know it just could be me and my skills like i have never had just excellent scarf tying skills like i ain't gonna even hold you sis but i i felt like this one was harder for me to manipulate um and it, as you guys can see it's kind of like riding up so i feel like before like i get home it's gonna be like this you know what i mean and that is something that you don't want okay like you don't want to be out and about and not realizing that your scarf has rose up or out and about and constantly having to pull it down so i <laughs> I don't know it could be just the way that i have mine it could be a chrissy problem but that is my issue with it i do feel like it is a cute idea and as far as just you know throwing something on to to go to the store i think it's perfect um i did decide to wear minimum makeup and you know my lounge clothes because i i feel like that is the idea of it to cover up your, your, you know, your jailhouse braids, honey. Yo, Queen Latifah and set it off type braids. Like, I feel like that is the whole, you know, thing of it. To, you know, have something that you can kind of throw on and just be casual with. And I love that idea. Like I said, my only issue with it is the scarf. I feel like it needs to be more thick or something. Something about this scarf is just, is giving me the blues and I'm not able to tie it like I want to tie it. But like I said, I do think it's an excellent idea. Now, I don't know how much this wig costs. So how much it costs is gonna determine a lot, honey, because yeah, I feel like if it's expensive, girl, you can just get a scarf and get one of your, um, your, your old wigs and do the same thing. <laughs> But if it's not expensive, like if it's a really inexpensive wig, I think it is perfect. Let me look and see. Child, my mannequin head is over there and it's usually back there and it like you gave me a heart attack. Hold on. Okay, so it looks like it's $20. So if it's $20, I just happen to see that on somebody's YouTube. I don't. Yeah. Okay, I see on here. It's yeah, it's 20. I see it ranging from 20 to $24. Okay. With that price range, then yes, I, I feel like it is worth it. Like, I, I think it is great. Um, you know, like I said, for throw on and go, I'm always getting back home. I go grocery shopping and I get home, I take off my hair and I'm getting ready to cook or whatever. And my kids remind me that I forgot something or my husband remind me that I forgot something. And especially if my husband not here, cause usually if he's here and he see I took my wig off, child, he'd be like, I go get it, Chrissy. <laughs> But if it's just me and the kids and I've forgotten something, I don't want to have to go through the trouble of putting my wig back on. So I feel like it is perfect for those type of moments. And like I said, just casual lying around and you don't want to be, you know, maybe you're, you're, you have company over and you don't want to have to put on a whole wig. You can just throw something like this on. I think it is an entire look for those days. And yeah, so I feel like it's worth it. 
I feel like it's worth it. So yeah, let me know down below what you guys think of it. Would you rock it? Um, I did see, uh, I think it was also fashionable. Looks like she was able to oh so 805 looks like she was able to do the top knot that my butt couldn't do so i guess you can i guess it was just a me problem after all so yeah let me know if you guys have decided to purchase this wig what do you think about it let me know down below in the comments and yeah y'all that is a pretty much it so i'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a full 360 and we can wrap this thing all the way up so this is obviously the unit in the front this is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. So obviously I'm just terrible at tying scarves. So yeah, because I also seen Queen of Mindset. She did the bow that I was trying to do that I couldn't do. So maybe it's just me, girl. I just don't know how to tie a scarf. Okay. I just don't know how to tie a scarf. <laughs> So, if you guys are interested in this unit, I will have a direct link to it down below in the description box for your convenience. And yeah, y'all, that is pretty much it. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, something you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not ready to subscribe, sis, click the subscribe button. And if you're not ready to follow me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and Facebook. I'm held to miss C on Snapchat, and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love bugs, next time. Bye.